What Coming is going at you guys, guys you know what to do today. Today. And you know I want to be straightforward with you guys, you guys and, um, and you know I want to be straightforward with you guys and um really a plane. Like I was saying, I want to be straightforward with you guys and stuff like that. And um I'm not going to edit this video like that. Like I might add music, but like I'm not going to like cut parts out because I want to show you guys like raw footage like this video, I want to see a Q&A video with me just sitting down, showing you guys. I'm not going to cut anything out this video. Because I know a lot of videos that I have, I cut certain things out with this video. I'm not going to cut anything out. So, um, I'm really not going to edit this video other than out of music, I don't think. Um, the first question in this Q&A comes from Robert Hopkins, and he asked best fig the by the way I, I didn't even read these questions at all so if you guys see me pause for a second to think don't get upset because i really ha have no idea what these questions are going to be um best figure in elite 35 um most wait best figure in elite 35 um oh i gotta think gotta think gotta think gotta think Mmm, I lied. I probably am gonna edit this. Ugh. Something crazy just happened right now. Um, best figure in Elite 35, probably the Triple H. I really like it. I really, really do like that figure. I like the face skin. I like the outfit. I like the coat and everything. Um, I actually got that figure, so I can actually say that I like it. It's up. We're seeing pictures. Mo favorite pay review. Um, favorite, favorite, favorite pay review. T. Uh, other than WrestleMania, because that's like a thing. Um, it used to be Royal Rumble, but the last two Royal Rumbles haven't been that impressive. Um, so I won't say Royal Rumble TLC. I'm obsessed with um tables. Like, I will pop so loud if anyone goes through a table. Like, I really, honestly will. Um, most talented in NXT. I gotta say, Sami Zayn. I gotta go with Sami Zayn. I like Sami Zayn. He's my favorite down there. I like him a little better than Neville, too. Um, CJ Stop Motions. He's pretty cool. You can subscribe to him. Um, asked, have you ever watched TNA Impact Wrestling? If you have, how do you feel about this show? Um, I do watch it sometimes. It depends. Like, if I hear about a certain match that's gonna happen, I'll watch it, but... I won't just turn on my TV and watch it because I don't like it. It it, it sucks. It really does. Like, I'm not gonna lie, there are some talented workers that put on great matches. But like the storyline, the way they handle their show, the promos are just horrible. Um can if you can make any WWE legend to come back and host Raw, who would it be? Um, Edge has done it a few times. He has done it, like, I don't even know, like, five times since he's been gone. He's also a Ross Manny on a lot of stuff. So, I wouldn't say Edge. Um, I would probably say Shawn Michaels. I would want to see Shawn Michaels host for a I think that would be epic, man. Um, all right. So, Dustin Green asks, can you answer this question? Hi. That's not a question. Uh... How do you feel if the shield came back? Um, I think it would be good. I think all of them are very evolved except Roman Reigns. I don't think Roman Reigns is since has evolved since he, he was in the shield. Almost he's added two moves to his moveset. Um he's wearing the same outfit. Um he's using the same theme song, same entrance. He hasn't evolved. And um it would be cool though, cause Dean Ambrose and Seth Rollins have evolved, and um, what Roman Reigns, you know, whatever. Um, Bryce Cup, you know, the boy Bryce, you know, over there, you you know who you are, Bryce. Um, as top ten favorite elites. Oh gosh, really? You're making me do this right now. This is not even gonna be my top ten because um, you asking me, you putting me right on the spot, man. And I just don't want to edit this video. I'm gonna have elite, some elites over there. I'll just, I'll just name some. They're, they're not my top ten, so I'll just name some. Um, elite thirty-four, John Cena. 
um, Elite 34, Rusev, Elite 32, Daniel Bryan, um, <laughs> I'm looking for stuff, um, WrestleMania Heritage, whatever, whatever, the WrestleMania 30, Elite, Shawn Michaels, um, I'm looking for stuff, the, the Finding Moments, um, John Cena, um, I'm, I'm really looking for stuff right now, I can't find it. You put me right on the spot with that. I'm only going to give you five. If you really want to know, you can ask me. And then I, uh, if you want to know, you can add, you can comment it again on another video. And then, um, or you can just ask me. Because you know my Instagram and stuff. And I'll really tell you my top ten. Because right now, I'm really on the spot. Right now. Like, really. Um, so, sorry for pronouncing your name wrong, okay? Like, I'm, I'm the second grade dropout, okay? Um... Robert Cardona asked Q and A. Hey Beastly, why do your videos always come out so weird? Like the background. I don't think my background's weird. I oh I know sometimes like um I have a light set up actually. Here's a secret. I have a light set up like it's right here. I'm not gonna show you guys, but I'll show you guys in another video maybe. But there's a light right there. Because um the light in my room is all the way over there and it lights up like half of the room good and um it's it makes it look yellowish because the to the paint on the wall looks weird. So it makes the room look yellowish and sometimes it makes me look way darker and yellowish than I actually am. So that's why I have this light up here. Yeah. Um Oh, and it moves because um sometimes I get really hype and then I'll shake the and it moves because sometimes I get really hype and then I'll just shake the whatever my video is on right now it's on an eating tray but sometimes it's on a bed. Um, can you send me one of your old figures? By the way, you're cool. No, I can't do that. I can't do that. Even if I want it, I don't want to. Even if I wanted to, I wouldn't because um, I play with all my figures. I really do. Not all. I have 331 figures. Yeah, I do count. Um, the killer, killer spike pie. I think that's his name. As um, worst character in WWE you would like to shoot. First of all, I, that's why I know your name is Killer Spike Pie, okay? Um, first of all, I don't hate, um, a WWE superstar or character that much that I would go to the point to want to shoot them. That is not happening. I wouldn't want to shoot any WWE character. So, I'm, if it, even if I do, did want to i wouldn't say it on youtube it's gonna make me sound like a crazy person so no no i'm not answering that. i'm sorry um isaac cantero asked do you think the undertaker and sing will versus each other at wrestlemania 32 i think you meant face each other at wrestlemania 32 but you know what it doesn't matter i know exactly what you meant uh you know isaac Cantero's another one that um has me on kick, so he's a good subscriber. He's a good beastly one. You know, I call you guys the beastly ones. The beastly ones are the name of my subscribers, but it's not catching on. You guys are the beastly ones, okay? That's the name of my subscribers. They are the beastly ones. Anyways, anyways, um, I think that they will face each other at WrestleMania 32, but honestly, I don't care about the match. I don't want to see it. I don't want to see it. Like, I might as well just have two grandpas coming in the ring and just facing each other. Honestly, I, I really, not. Nah, it's not even that. It's not even their age. I just don't care about it. Like, if it, if this was, um, it's, not, it's really not even their age. I just don't want to see the match, to be honest. Um, what's better, what's a better defining moment? Um, Razor Ramon or Hulk Hogan? Um, I don't, um, and, um, Vladimir Barargan asked, um, I don't, um, I'm sorry if I pronounced your name wrong, because I probably did. Um, I don't have any of those figures, but, um, from what I've seen, I've seen them in the store, 
but I never wanted to get them. I always wanted to get something else other than that. I never wanted them really. Um, where well, I was in Razor, I have I've seen Hogan, but um, I think Razor looks way better. Like if I had a choice, but if if there was um nothing in the store else for me to get, there was only two figures, Hogan and Razor. I get Razor hands down. It's a better looking figure, definitely. Um. Kane is a TV 14 legend. As what era do you prefer? Old school era or present era? Ooh, it depends on what old school you're talking about. Um, I think when you say old school, I think he may be talking about attitude era when you say old school versus the era now. But um, my favorite era is ruthless aggression. Mhm, mm that's my favorite era, better than the attitude era. But um, I think you're talking about attitude era versus now. Um, now, I pick now, definitely, hands down, hands down, hands down, hands down, hands down, Attitude Era is overrated, Attitude Era is overrated, like, I seen this stuff, I watched the WWE Network, 999, you know, all that stuff, and, um, it's overrated, man, it really is, like, there's only, there, there's very few people that shine in that era, like, it really, like, they were like now there's like so many guys stepping up to the plate getting new main events right then they were just rotating the same guy same guy same guy same guy same guy same guy over and over again but you say john cena but john cena seth Rollins is getting the main event dean ambrose getting main event bray wyatt is getting main events rowan reigns is getting main events brock like everybody's getting main events now and you know it, it tests people it makes them become a better talent and that's why you don't rotate the same guys over and over again, man. So, I take this era over the Attitude Era, definitely. Even though some things that you do may not be the best, but, um, you know, it's just my opinion. They didn't grow up in that era. <sighs> yeah. So, Attitude Era marks, please calm down. Um, when do you get do? Well, oh gosh. What's wrong with me? Do I have dyslexia? When will you do. A giveaway and can it be elite? Um, I don't know when I'm doing another giveaway. I am gonna do one, I really am gonna do another one. I'm just trying to, this, what I'm trying to figure out right now is when that's what I'm trying to figure out. And can it be elite? I don't know when it's what it's gonna be. And um, when I find out what it's gonna be, I'm gonna be the one to decide, okay? Um, Will you fight me at WrestleMania? The last question came from Alan Bettner. This question comes from Jeffrey Mendez. Will you fight me at WrestleMania? I will. If WWE rents out the place for long enough and lets us come in here, there, and tear down the house. We will have an awesome match. I'll put together the spots and everything. You know me and you. We're gonna have a good match, definitely. Uh, uh, we're gonna be in Texas. Meet me, meet me in Texas. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not even, I don't even know. <laughs> oh my God, I wish. Um, James Giles asks, "Have you ever made a custom figure?" No, but I have bought a custom. Figure. Um, Dijon. Prange, Prange, I don't even know, man. You, you know, you know who you are. I'm sorry. Um, guys, who would you like to see answer John Cena Open Challenge? Um, I like to see somebody from NXT. Um, um, Sami Zayn. I like to see Sami Zayn. No, cause I would like to see Finn Balor answer John Cena's Open Challenge and lose. Cause I like Finn Balor, but. He's kind of overrated. Like, today with Tommy's better than Finn Balor. Just because, um, you know, face playing blah, 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 That, like, no. Like, he's good, but not better than Hideo with Tommy, Sammy, Zane, and stuff. Like, no. He's better than Kevin Owens, though. So I give him that. <sighs> um, The Anthony Show. What app do you use to edit your video? Right now, I'm using iMovie. I will need to edit this video. Um, but sometimes I use Windows. That's about it. iMovie and Windows. Um, Windows Movie Maker. Zach's Wrestling, another boy out there. As 
are you planning to attend SummerSlam? Don't even bring this up. It's just bring the tear to my eye. Look at this. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not crying. But I was literally about to order. I was literally, I was up. My mom was up for 9 o'clock in the morning. And she woke me up saying, oh, I'm going to buy the SummerSlam tickets, blah, blah, blah. I was like, okay. And we were on the site and they were like please hold or whatever blah blah blah. wait wait for this to load and we were on there 10 o'clock as soon as they say the tickets were open and guess what they were like oh it's sold out and i was about to order them the same day so you know what i'm probably gonna do i'm probably going to the raw after the night after summer sun that's what i'm gonna do i'm going to the raw at night after summer sun it's gonna be fun yeah if i can't go to summer sun i go to the second best thing i guess so um the savage rose 2015 as favorite food of all time um i'm not gonna give you a favorite food because it's like a tough one i'm gonna give you two favorite foods three top three um boneless buffalo bites boneless buffalo chicken bites you know if you follow me on instagram you know what those are mom makes them all the time crabs and pizza my favorite foods um favorite elite and basic figure oh my oh my that's a tough that's really tough uh, i'm gonna think of one favorite elite figure um uh, bray wyatt 28 bray wyatt and basic um i like the same basic same same best basic figure I think so. Um, and that question came from Insane TJ. Is that tasty kid? <gasps> and Christopher Clearmont asked, How long have you been collecting WWE figures? Um, my brother been collecting them since like 2005, 4. 2005. And, um, yeah. And then he stopped liking it. Like, he, he, he not into it like that anymore. And then I inherited his old wrestling figure. I was like, oh, I like wrestling. I was flipping through channels, you know. I was like, oh, I like wrestling now. And boom, he gave me his two figures that he had. And then I started collecting after that. Um, So, I've already been collecting for, technically, I've probably been collecting for eight years. Technically. Yeah, eight years, eight, no, seven years, seven years, sorry. Collecting seven years, but not hardcore. I've just been buying a little bit, but not that much. I've been hardcore for, like, a few. Um, Sax Sports and Wrestling Ass Collection Video. Oh, God, <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, this is, like, the most ass thing on my channel. I need to do a collection video, man. Everybody wants to see my collection video. Like, people will message me on kick. And then they'll just be like, let me see your collection. 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 And it's like, like, I'm going to do it soon. I really am. Because, like, I'm sick of all the questions and stuff like that. So, I'm going to do it very soon. I'm telling you right now. Um, do you believe that you can be, um, that's when Jeffrey Mendez asked, do you believe that you can be a WWE wrestler when you grow up? Yes, I don't believe. I believe. And not only do I believe, I know, I know that I'm going to be a WWE superstar, man. I know it. I know it in my bones. I feel it. I feel the power. Um, WWE figures, 434 eyes. Will you please do an entire WWE figure collection and will you do more vlogs? Y'all, um, if I'm just going, like, doing something boring, I'm not going to whip my camera out and do a vlog, but, like, I'm going downtown, um, to Times Square and stuff, I'll definitely do a vlog. I'll, I'll definitely vlog, so I will vlog more a lot. Um, um, I already talked about the WWE collection video, I don't need to, um, do that again. Um... Can you do my career on your channel? I don't want to do it. I'm going to be completely honest. I don't want to do it because I already finished it on my own, on my Xbox. And um, I don't want to do it again. It's boring. It sucks. It sucks. It sucks. Okay. 
really that comes from the yes man 107 now jeremiah hard asks how would you feel if the boy seth rollins turned face um you know seth rollins released a new corny finisher um you know i like seth rollins either way i honestly do he's you know again as you said he's the boy um i'll stick with seth rollins no matter what he does he'll face uh neutral whatever he is I'll, i'm sticking with seth rollins and i like seth rollins um i don't know i i, I think a face seth rollins in the main roster would be interesting so um i'm not against it um well face single seth rollins because he's ready to heal when he was in the shield um jeremiah hard does that galaxy k55 ask best figure in elite 34 page um favorite superstar of all time john cena current favorite superstar of all time john cena which superstar would you like to come back that retired Shawn michaels i love Shawn michaels i really do um the figure that you want um that and then show off 2204 <laughs> as the figure that you want Mattel to make in the future, um, Elise Seth Rollins. I know they're making Elise Seth Rollins, but like, I, it's probably gonna be with the black, and I don't want that. I want the gold that he's wearing now. Um, if they were championship, mmm, mmm. Also, Tuffy. This is Tuffy. I like the. I will say the WWE champ World Heavyweight Championship, but I like the World Heavyweight Championship not because it's my favorite, because I think my, honestly my favorite is the WWE, but because it helped people from getting buried. Like now that there's only f so few titles, everybody's getting buried. But um, there's only one world. If there's only like one world title, it's gonna be hard for everybody to you know get a nice spot in the card. But you know it is what it is, man. Um, but I would say no, nah, it's not my favorite. I'll say WWE Championship, whatever. Um, Michael Awesome Boy 711. I actually like that name a lot. As, are you making a WWE Fit Collection video? And when are you unboxing all those figures you just got? I did unbox those figures. You can check them out. I, I did it, um, last week, actually. Yeah, you can check it out. I did already. Like, six days ago. Um, who's your favorite WWE Superstar? Matt. Fu. Matt Foot, one four HD. These, these two names are messing my head up, man. Favorite WWE superstar, John Cena. Boo boo doo boo, John Cena shit. <clears throat> Dejan Pringle asks, "Do you have PS3? And if you do, add me. I I, I don't know if <clears throat> I don't know if people want me to tell him his name, so I'm not gonna tell his name. I don't have PS4. I'm sorry, I don't. I have Xbox One." My name is Abisa with Zero Two, and I have Xbox 360. My name is Abisa with Zero Two. Um, who's your favorite WWE superstar? My favorite is John Cena. My favorite is John Cena too. We could be friends, yeah. Um, wrestling figure and gamer review asked, what figure would you choose in WWE Series 51? I don't even know. Like, I'm not the type of person that's like, oh, this is in 51. This series in this figures in 52. This this figures in Elite Series 34. Like I forget what figures in what series. I forget all the time. Um, I think the the um Seth Rollins and the Sami Zayn are the figures that was in um <coughs> 34. I think so. I really think so. Um, I mean 31. So I probably picked the Sami Zayn. I think that's in 51. <laughs> Um, CM best in the world as well. He has the best in the world initials. B I T W as. Hey Beastly, my question is why do you only make five second videos? Er, this video is like twenty something minutes, man. Um, and have you seen the length of the TBW videos? Like those are like almost an hour, for real. A half an hour, an hour, two hours, TVW WrestleMania. Like, my videos are pretty long. 
most of my videos are pretty long. Unless I'm like telling you guys something like, oh, Roos is going to be on TVW this week. Maybe that will be like a seven second video. But like if I want to tell you guys something, um, I'm going to make a video. And it's not five seconds. It's, mm, most of my videos are pretty long. They really are. All right. Last question from Catalina Ospina. Ospina. I don't know, man. Ask, are you thinking of doing pig fat? Ooh, that's the question of the day. That's the question of the day. Oh my god, oh my god. No, I'm not thinking of that whatsoever. Um, are you doing some figures in Elite 36? Would you prefer Cena or Rollins? Everybody know that John Cena and Seth Rollins are my favorite wrestlers. Ever. Ever. Not ever. Seth Rollins is my favorite wrestler ever. He's our current favorite wrestler. Um, John Cena. John Cena is better than Seth Rollins, 100%. Um, I've always stuck by John Cena. John Cena's always been my favorite guy. It always was John Cena and Jeff Hardy. I don't. When I was younger, in like 2009, it was always John Cena and Jeff Hardy. But that was like the point. Point of this video is a Q&A, and I just answered everybody's questions thank you this was a pretty pretty long video um i enjoyed everybody's questions i really did um i told you i was gonna answer all of the questions and i did i didn't edit that much of this video and um, yeah guys don't forget to like this video leave a comment subscribe and uh, oh yeah guys sorry i want to talk to you about you stuck by the end of this video i know oh you are a true great subscriber if you didn't stick by the end of this video you're still a good subscriber but anyways um i made a second channel called the beastly boy 0202 okay i made a second channel called the beastly boy 0202 well, why did i make it why did i make a second channel just in case anything were to happen to this channel i'm telling you right now I don't know what I would do if you guys didn't know where to go or where you would go if anything happened to this channel. So that's what the second channel is for. Um, I'm doing that just in case anything, this channel ever got terminated or anything. I won't be making videos like that on it, but please subscribe to that channel um, just in case anything will ever happen to this channel. And um, I might make a few videos on there just to update you guys and stuff. But, um, yeah, so if anything ever were to happen to this channel, I would want you guys over there. So please subscribe to that channel. Link in the description. And don't forget to like this video. Leave a comment. Subscribe. As always, till tomorrow, know what to do. Tell you every time. Tell your video. Stay beastly.